Hello history fans, today we are in Ripon in Yorkshire and we are going to be visiting Fountains Abbey. Fountains Abbey is located three miles southwest of Ripon in North Yorkshire. It was founded in 1132 and operated for 407 years until the dissolution of the monasteries in 1539. Its story begins after a dispute at St Mary's Abbey in York. Thirteen monks were expelled. They were taken in by the Archbishop of York, who provided them with land in the valley of the River Skell. The land provided them with everything they needed to create a monastery – wood, stone, protection from the weather, and running water. It was the six springs which rose in the valley which inspired the name Fountains. Shortly after settling in the valley, the monks applied to join the Cistercian Order. It was a quickly growing movement with over 500 houses, including nearby Revo. In 1135, Fountains was established under Clairvaux Abbey in Burgundy, which was under the rule of St Bernard. The monks set about constructing wooden buildings at this stage. A stone church was added shortly after, and in 1143, under the abbot Henry Murdoch, work began on a larger church. Within three years, an aisled nave had been added to the stone church, and the first permanent cloister buildings were built. In 1146, an angry mob, annoyed at Murdoch because of his role in opposing the election of William Fitzherbert as Archbishop of York, attacked the abbey and burnt down all but the church and some surrounding buildings. The community recovered swiftly from the attack and went on to establish four daughter houses. Later in the 12th century, an extensive building program took place, which included the completion of repairs to the damaged church and building more accommodation for the increasing number of recruits. The chapter house and the new church were also finished. During the European famine of 1194, the Abbey provided support for six months to local people in the form of food, shelter and spiritual care. Famine was followed by the spread of disease and the Abbey helped those who needed treatment. In the first half of the 13th century, fountains increased in reputation and prosperity. The church was enlarged and an infirmary was built at this time. However, these fortunes didn't last. By the second half of the century and into the 14th, due to poor financial management, high taxation and attacks from the Scots, the Abbey was in dire physical and material state. The Abbey was then pushed to the brink of ruin by the Black Death of 1348 to 1349 and the resulting loss of manpower and income. Its fortunes were somewhat regained in the second half of the 15th century and its debts began to be reduced. The Abbey undertook much needed restoration, culminating at the end of the century with the construction of the impressive Hoobies Tower. The Abbey was surrendered when its seizure was ordered under Henry VIII during the dissolution of the monasteries in 1539. The Abbey buildings and land were seized by the Crown and sold in 1540 to Sir Richard Gresham. I hope you enjoyed our exploration of Fountains Abbey. If you did, please hit that like button. And even better, why not become one of our amazing subscribers and hit the bell icon so that we can let you know next time we upload a historical adventure. Bye for now.